Melina Kanakavides, everybody. seen you in a long time. How long is it since you've been it's here? It's been way too long, but I'm very excited that there was chemistry with Drew Carey because I'm also from Ohio. Cleveland was our big city. I'm a Cleveland girl, Akron girl, so really? You're from there Akron? might be chemistry with there us. There definitely is chemistry with okay, us. I'll tell you now, I love Akron <laughs> and I'll tell you why. Tires. I know. They made the tires for the entire auto industry for years. They Akron did. did. Yeah. They called it the rubber capital. Thank you, Akron. <laughs> Thank you, Akron, for the smooth ride. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know. I like Akron. It's a nice place. Lots of nice things come out of Akron. Yeah, thank you. Oh. <laughs> um, what about uh, what about the uh, the uh, big uh, CSI show? Are you still having yes, a nice time? Because uh, Sinise is a cranky just... bastard, isn't he? <laughs> <laughs> He's actually a sweetheart. Um, yeah, yeah. No, did you like me hanging from that that like seven That's story very building? Exciting. And I was really doing that. Really? Yeah. There's a harness on me. Yeah. You couldn't see they was, you know erased the thingies, the wires, but it was it was so cool. I actually sent uh, emailed a photo to my husband from the iPhone, and then I the response quickly was, "Are you crazy? Yeah. <laughs> no, we got two children. Does Get he down. does he type? Does, he's got yeah, a very big does, iPhone he now. And he's, no, he's, he's got the little. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> Are you, are you are you gadgety? Do you have I all like, these I'm a Mac girl. I love my, I, I, my parents just had their 50th wedding anniversary and I did the whole iMovie and the book. No, we, we, we have to be, you know, it's, fair and balanced here, uh, Mac and PC. I have to see, I like my the Mac stuff. PC. Well, I like the Mac stuff, but I have to see these commercials where that, like, groovy kid is picking on the PC guy. I'm like, <laughs> piss off, you little rat. Kind of like, I mean, the PC guy's like, just trying to have his life in me. I mean, and I, and I like Mac stuff as well, and I'm thinking, knock that crap off. <laughs> Drives me mad. I'm gonna, oh, I'm so trendy. Oh, are you? I'm going to get a PC just to annoy you, you little <laughs> uh, Can I say that? No, don't no matter. Hey, how was your summer? What did you do? I had an amazing summer. I met the Pope this summer. What? I did meet... The Pope? I, what, in a bar? I did. Where did you meet him? Uh, no. I actually, I'm, our patriarch, the Greek Orthodox patriarch, was You're not invited. Catholic, you're Greek, or, Greek we're Orthodox. Greek Orthodox. Right, okay. But it's basically, the, we're very, 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 very similar, very right. close. It was one church, it was called the Apostolic Church. If those of you who are, um, go to church or religious, um, it's, uh, I believe, the one holy Catholic and Apostolic Church. When the schism happened... When, when did the schism happen? Uh, the schism happened about a thousand years ago. Well, what happened then? Why was I, there I a schism? I guess there were some translational problems. You know, there weren't Macs, the cell phones, yeah, right. or yeah, PCs. Yeah, 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 yeah. So people <laughs> couldn't, you know... So the Greek Orthodox yes. and the Catholic Church split off from we, each other. We split off. It was one church. Church, it was an apostolic church, and they split off, and they took the, the word Catholic, which is really a universal, uh, meaning universal, because the apostles created Christianity from St. Paul, St. Peter, quick lesson, so then they, uh, <laughs> Catholic No, I, was I, I need it, <laughs> tell me. <laughs> anyway. You might want to do a bit of saving while you're here as well, I think. Um, our archbishop uh, uh, was invited uh, invited by our patriarch to bring some people together, and they invited me, which I was very honored, but I was told to bring my whole family. My girls included five and eight, two little girls, five and eight. So, I mean, three hours of church is a long time for anyone. Yeah, no, tell <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> but we were holding our breath because the, we were at... at this is at the Vatican. It was just beautiful. The patriarch and the I've pope coming to the together. Yeah, it's very nice. Oh, it was beautiful. And they said mm. the creed in Greek, uh, in the original. Do you speak Greek? I do speak Greek. So you knew what they were saying then? Yes. Right. It was it was amazing. And my girls speak Greek. Right. And uh, five years old, they speak Greek. Well, That's they spoke clever. Greek before they spoke English. Oh, that, there's the trick. And uh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> but. But of course, they hear Italian or Latin, and they just assume everything's Greek. So right. um, we were in church literally for three hours before to meeting the Pope and the Patriarch in this little room. Did, the, did you mention to the Pope that you weren't a Catholic, that you were Greek Orthodox? He knew. Oh, he, he invited did? our 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 Patriarch who sat with him. And they're the, the two, two together. Yeah, they're, they're two heads. Oh, that's nice. So it was just beautiful, and it was yeah. cool. But um, five minutes before we're going to meet the the big pope, the guy, the yeah. main guy. It's not like, you know, it's, it's the regular sized pope. There's only one pope. It's not like, <laughs> not like you, you work your way up to the big pope, little pope, middle sized pope, big pope. There's one pope, well, one holy father, that's who it is. That's so true. 
Pope. Yeah. Well, for us, there's two because, you know, oh, well, of the course, there's the patriarch. So yeah, yeah. He's, and he's our Pope. So right. I prepped the girls before we were going to meet. Uh, and I said to my little one and my big one, I'm like, so you guys remember that we're going to kiss the ring. You do your cross when you're in church. You do this whole thing. I mean, I had it all drilled in. So Karina finally, my little one looks at me and she's like, okay, so tell me about these guys again. Are they like best friends with God or something? And I said, <laughs> Yeah, yeah, not bad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Now, listen, does the Pope watch the CSI show? Um, do I don't think so. <laughs> really? I don't, I don't think that's on his agenda. I don't know. Uh, I mean, I think there must come a point in someone, you know, even if you're like the head of a giant church, there must be a time when you think, you know, I'm just going to watch TV tonight. I, I don't know. I mean, I did have a bishop in church uh, taking a picture of me, and it was the most surreal, bizarre thing. A TMZ bishop? I know. We was <laughs> wow. How odd. Ah. That's yes. fantastic. I mean, terrible. I mean, no, oh, it was sure. interesting. It was bizarre. Listen, listen, I wish we had more time. I'm fascinated about this. Yes. Uh, this uh, but we're out of time. Will you come back and talk more about this? Yes, I would Very love to. Very interesting to me. Very interesting to me, it. in fact. Melina Kanakaridis, everybody. We'll be right back. <laughs> There's been lots of moments when I felt guilty. <laughs> I feel a little bit guilty right now. <laughs> but it was worth it. <laughs> Please welcome the beautiful Melina Kanakaridis, everybody. <laughs> oh, Melina, Melina. <laughs> How lovely to see you. May I say, may I say, I, I, I mean this in a completely respectful way, yeah. just how dynamite you look tonight. Oh. I mean, just, wow. Thank you. I mean, just, wow. Yeah. You're, uh, you're clearly in some guilty. kind of... Guilty. Uh, are you guilty? I'm feeling very guilty. Are you? Yes. Do tell. Why? But it was worth it. Uh, it's always... I wanted to get that reaction it. from well, you. Well, it's, it's, uh, <laughs> it's not just... You would get a lot of reaction where... You, wow. <laughs> You look uh, now. Of course, uh, I was going to say you, uh, you're uh, you're Greek, of course. Yes. Uh, you, uh, Greek. Did you have a nice Cinco de Mayo? Is that a big? big thing? <laughs> yes, yes. I'm a Greek who loves um, <clears throat> loves the tequila, but the tequila doesn't always love me. But it, yes. Tequila, you say? Yes. Really? Do you drink? I thought it was ouzo they drink in Greece. I don't like ouzo. Do you not? I don't. Well, I you can really... drink past that. I mean, you know, yeah. You... <laughs> I have some experience here. What you do is you have about three or four ouzos, and you're like, I don't care about uh... anything. Yeah. <laughs> Do you know, you, you like tequila, really? I do, I do. I actually Do, do. you do the salt and the lemon and the... Ow! Yes. Or do you do the, uh, the uh, margaritas? Uh, both. Really? Yes. Yes, uh -huh. I'll, do, I'll start with the margarita and then somebody will convince me to do the salt with the lemon and the... Yeah, no, I, I don't know what that bit is. What is that? It's after you uh, slam it and then you, you do that. So. Where do you go to do this? Mexico or Greece? <laughs> hey, in Greece uh, they do the plate smashing, don't yes. they? Yes. Um, why? I don't know. I don't know where that started. I, I think that was just like, you know, usually they throw dollar, well, they throw money. Who throws money? Uh, where have you been? When you're dead. They do. They throw money. And I think the money is much more exciting than, of course, oh, the breaking yeah, of the, the plates. Oh, yeah. The Greek Orthodox weddings, they, sometimes they pin money on the bride, don't they? Yeah, exactly. they uh, go, yes. They, uh, they put not necessarily money, but lots of Favors gold. And... Gold and, and yes. Oh, yeah. Yes. It's, it's a good thing. It is a good thing. Yeah. Yes. What happens in the divorce? Who gets to keep it? Um, <laughs> Um, yeah, I, I don't know. Fortunately, I, I'm not on, in one of those opposite marriages. Oh, really? Yes. <laughs> hey, uh, now, I, th I have a theory about the plate spinning. Yes. It was, was uh, you remember these acts that they used to have in the Ed Sullivan show? The, uh, yeah, 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 the, yeah, 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 with the guy I, with the stick. Yeah, it was, yeah. it was a Greek one of them and he was crap. <laughs> and, and he started incorporating it into his act. And then going, opa. Yeah, yeah. Yes, I like that. What was that again, opa? Opa. Yeah, what does that mean? In, is it like ole? Uh, yeah, kind of like ole or, or um, uh, what's the thing that we say when, uh, you know. Hooray. Uh, hey. Oh, hey. Hey. <laughs> I don't know. Really? There's an actual Greek word that means hey? <laughs> Hey was one of those words that everybody said hey, you know, it didn't matter what language you had, you just went hey! <laughs> I'm trying to think of what we say when we're dancing, I don't know. I do know that, um, okay, 
is uh, short for Ola Kala, which means everything's cool, everything's good. Ola Kala? Ola Kala, oh, okay. Oh, right. Yeah. 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 Is yeah. everything Ola Kala with Ola you there? Ola Kala, yeah. everything's good. What have you been up to then with the CSI? You, uh, did you write one of them recently? Yes, that's what I've been that's up to. That's amazing. Yeah, it was really fun. Has it been on yet? And May, uh, May 13th, uh, the, the, a week the, from today. And they're going to, you wrote the episode, did you write yourself a much bigger part? I wrote, yes. Yeah. <laughs> yes, are you kidding? Yes. Yeah, and what about, uh, you know... I'm the, guilty. What about Sinise? He's like, oh, he leaves. Uh, no, no, no. <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh, he's got indigestion and he goes out and he, he leaves at the beginning of the episode and then he comes back going, oh, that's better. I had very, I had a very unsightly bout of diarrhea or something. I would do that to Sinise. Uh, um, no, I didn't give him diarrhea. All right. Uh, <laughs> I did give him my badge, though, at the beginning. I, I, I actually quit in the first couple of minutes of the show. I, you know, if I ever get to write an episode of this show, I'm quitting. In the <laughs> <laughs> so, you know, if I, I think if I actually quit, they wouldn't notice. Um, I'd notice. No, no, I, I, I'd have to actually physically leave. I mean, mentally, I checked out after the second year, but I, but I think that the... Uh, I don't think they would notice. I'd have to... You leave, and even then, I don't know because the lighting is so bad in this studio. <laughs> They'd think, Oh, he's quiet tonight. They'd think, <laughs> Do you know, I, I thought the first season of your show, yes. actually, the CSI New York, I thought the lighting was kind of scary. Yeah, I, yes. I know it's kind of odd to talk about the light, but the lighting wasn't good. And then in the no. second season, the lighting changed, and I was like, Oh, wow. Yeah, it, it was, um, it was night and day. Yeah, no, I you know, great now. Finished really five. Seen. Yeah. Five seasons? Five seasons. That's fantastic. Five seasons. Did you have a big party? Um, we did. We had a hundredth episode, huge party. And uh, towards the end of the fifth season, like when we, you know, I, I wrote mine um, and then we had the season finale, which airs the next night. Oh, uh, right. And it's May 13th. Is, is it a cliffhanger? Is, it's a cliffhanger. Oh, right, right. And um, I enjoy a cliffhanger. Yes, it's a, it's a big one. We all get shot at, uh, possibly. Oh, hey. I don't know if I'm allowed to tell that. <laughs> Way to keep it a secret. Aye, aye, aye. Aye. It's aye, all right. Aye, aye. It's all right. This show kidding. is so dark, no one's actually here. <laughs> I'm sorry. Woo. Do you know uh, what it works, though, for us having a dark show is Magic Week. We, when we have yes. Magic Week here, the magicians are like, we love the lighting in here. We, we, because <laughs> you, you can't see them. I, do, you, do you love magic? I, I do love magic, actually. You, I didn't used to love it, and then I suddenly fell in love with it. I'm a member of the Magic Castle. Stop. Yes, are I you am. a magician? No. <laughs> But I love it. I, I, it's, it's one of the most, uh, it, it's, it's a great place. It's a quintessential L.A. I'm sorry, I'm going to have to stop yes, you there. I'm quintessential. Sorry. Quintessential. 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 I mean, it's, it, when you think of a, a, you know, there's not a huge history, I mean, there's a huge history in the world of film. Ma uh, magic. But there's a magic history here. In, in L.A., yeah. Well, in, didn't, uh, in, Houdini was, in fact, um, pretty, pretty historically magic. He was American. Magic. And he was American. <laughs> No, I am a big fan of uh, the magic. And the, do you ever have you ever been sawn in half? Uh, I I I have not, but I would do it. You would? I would. Well, we can have you uh, sawn in half here. Can we do magic it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I want to do that. Well, no, no, we do it. What no, we do really? is we're uh, we're going to have a magic week later in the year, and what we'll do is um, we'll have you sawn in half. We'll break because we did it. Do you, have you familiar with uh, Kristen Bell? Yes. The, the actress. Yes. Kristen, yes. Lovely woman. Yes. She's we great. sawed her in half. She's great. You did not. We did. We sawed her in half, and she was she was. Great about it, wasn't she? Yeah. yeah. She uh, and now she can work in both movies and television. Yeah, it's fantastic. Yeah, it's amazing. And she has quite a voice, you know that. She has a great voice. We did yeah. a Alzheimer's benefit. Not so much benefit. now after the. <laughs> um, we did an Alzheimer's benefit together. I, uh, did, did uh, she I, say? I, she sang a song. I did Lola, uh, whatever Lola wants, oh. and um, she was wonderful in it. We had a great time, really? and I didn't really even see the scar from being so. No, nervous. no, yeah. <laughs> I like the idea of you and uh, Kristen Bell together. Yeah. <laughs> oh, shut up. Shut up. There you go, being guilty. Dude. <laughs> Such filthy minds. I meant in a male sexual fantasy way. Oh, my God. You're so filthy. <laughs> I mean, it's always a joy seeing you. And the show is just going from strength to strength. It's, it's fantastic. Tell Sinise that uh, he's dead to me. Okay, and, uh, I will. <laughs> and I'll, we'll see you next time. <laughs> Melina Kanakarini is everybody.
please welcome the lovely Melina Kanakaridis, everybody. Melina Kanakaridis. Yeah. And hot tonight. Are you going Thank out you. after or something? You look wow. Yes. And Are I have you? to say hi. Hair. Yeah, I know it is a little bit. Yeah. I, I, no, I thought you did it for me. I did, I did. Your, you know, well, your hair is more kind of Mine's like big hair. Yeah, it's big. It's not that big. It's a, it's a it's not it's not like big hair, like you know, 80s big hair. Well, it can get that way. Really? You know, if it rains, it kind of gets larger and does your hair get bigger when it's rains? Yes. Oh. You know. That That's why, like, is that why you live in California? Um, yes. To keep your <laughs> to keep your hair small. To keep my hair small. Yeah. But it doesn't work on this show. Well, you well no, you've probably used it. Have you got yeah. mousse or product? Oh in yes, it? I use it. Really? I do, I do, and I have Monty who who's who's fantastic. Monty. He's my hair stylist. You have a, your own personal hairstylist. Yes, he's amazing, amazing. Does he follow you around everywhere? Everywhere. Really? Yes. He's Is he Canadian? Running. He's right over there. No, I'm just kidding. Um, no, no, no. He's a good boy. I love him very much. Well, <laughs> Are you implying that Canadians are naughty in some way? Maybe just a what little bit. What have you bit. got against Canada all of a sudden? I don't. Nothing. All that right. snake is staring at me. Yeah, he's so very is cute. the cup. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> hey, I have a question, actually. I have a, I have a question. Yes. <laughs> Do you know at the beginning of the show when these two young girls were on and they'd made the t-shirt? The t-shirt? Yeah, was that creepy when I was talking to I felt I was maybe no, a little creepy. No, I thought creepy. you were extremely appropriate. Actually, you know what's funny? I'm, I'm doing something where people can make t-shirts. I'm uh, Susan G. Komen and Haynes have gotten together and we're raising money to end breast cancer. Right. And you can go That's online and, and, yeah, and make your own t-shirt. So they can go back on and put you on it and say we're also fighting breast cancer. It's kind of, it's awesome. <laughs> Okay. All right, whatever, whatever gets me out of the creepy area, <laughs> yeah. I'm kind of for. I just, I think I haven't, I think a lot of men don't notice uh, that, you know, time has passed and they have become creepy. No. <laughs> well, that's why you have family that will tell you that you are yes. creepy. Yes, yes, I know. I yeah. have a lot of them that tell me But you me could if never I'm... be creepy. You're beautiful no. and elegant. Uh, well, is, your, is your husband ever creepy? Uh, well, uh, uh, no. No. <laughs> No, and not not yet. But I will tell him when he is, and I will call you and let you know that you're creepy because I love you and you're not creepy. All right then, because I'm Ever. very worried about that. No, you're not. Right? Okay. No. Do you have daughters? I have two. What age are they? Oh, stop it! Because now you're being creepy. <laughs> no, I didn't mean it like that. No, see, that's not what I meant. What did you mean? I meant well, how would you feel about them making T-shirts about some guy? That's what I meant. An old fellow on TV. Would you, would you be upset about it? And then I thought, well, you know, if they're five, they probably won't be making T-shirts. No, no, no. I'll stick to the fighting the breast cancer T-shirts. That'll be nice. Yeah, I think I probably yeah, should Yeah, I think that's too. good. Yeah, you know, yeah. they're pink and cute. Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah right. But that's okay. Yeah. You're not creepy. How are you otherwise? I'm fantastic. How's Sinise doing? How's Sin He's good. He's good. Really? We just he, does, he, does he still smell like biscuits? <laughs> <laughs> He smells, but not like biscuits. Oh, yeah. <laughs> no, it's good. It's good. Season six. We just we're just wow. finishing up season six. A couple more episodes. Wow. And it's good. Those yeah. fans that uh, really follow the show since like season two, where we didn't solve the case, or season three, actually Shane Casey, we finally end that case. All right. Yeah. Uh, what, what the happens? bad guy. Well, what? I don't know. I have to. They have to tune in and watch. You probably do know. And I do just, know. Yeah, yeah. I do know. Yeah. It's good. Do you All follow, I'm happy about do you is that follow uh, crime shows yourself, given that you're on one? Or do you kind of watch them and go, oh, I, I know how this is done? Yeah, no, no. I'm really good at like, you know, at home when people call me up and they say, hey, this happened. What 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 does that mean? You know, like oh, you I can figure it out yes, on other shows? you know, shows? I can find fibers and, you know, I'm really good at that. <laughs> now you're I'm being really creepy, good. aren't you? <laughs> What do you That's watch on TV then? Well, if you don't watch the crime shows, do you watch uh, Dancing with the Stars, that kind of thing? My mother does. Right. You know, my parents actually um, live with us. That would be you, though, if I was asking about you. No, 
you, uh, no, well, I kind of inadvertently watch things that my kids and my family watch because, you know, my my parents live with us about six months out of the year. Hello, I think I your know. husband might be a saint. He I'm is not. an angel man. He's an angel man. In fact, I I just um, you know, she's watching uh, all those shows with my kids. Uh, the Dancing with the Stars. Um, you know, of course, the the singing one, which of course is a huge singing show. One. American, American Idol. <laughs> yes, yes. Uh, the singing one. <laughs> but I mean, they're awesome, and the kids love it. The only uh, thing is, is that recently, um, my father, we, my father has a hearing kind of thing right. issue, so the TV's right. really loud. And my husband bought him these earphones. Are you that, living in a sitcom? I, I am. Oh, I am. And he bought him these earphones so his TV could be as loud as he wanted it, and the rest of us could right. watch it at normal. And um, it reminded me of your opening speech about pulling the queen's finger. Oh yes, yeah. yeah. Because my father, apparently, when he's listening. To to TV on his hear <laughs> ear, yes. Well, it's like he doesn't think the he rest of know. us can hear. <laughs> so <laughs> my husband's like, Dad, Dad, land the plane, yeah. land the plane, you know. Uh, that know. makes me very happy for some reason. <laughs> See, that's how I want to grow old. We're in headphones and fart really loud. <laughs> ah, good times. <laughs> But it's, it's good. It's, it always adds for a fun dynamic. Like uh, earlier this week, I couldn't speak. I was sick. <clears throat> I don't know if you've ever lost your voice, but the doctor put me on strict. You cannot use your voice at all. And if you try not to talk, it's very hard. It's really difficult, especially for me and you. Yeah. This, this is the first like time I've ever tried it. Look. Right. right. So um, my mom, God love her, is trying to understand what I'm saying. And I'm like, the kids need to go brush their teeth. So I'm going, and my mom's going, and I'm like, you can, you can talk. Why are you mouthing? And she was like mouthing with me. It was driving me crazy. But maybe, but maybe she couldn't be heard over the loud fartiness of your dad. <laughs> we'll never true. solve this. We're, we're out of time already. We're out of time. Are we out of time? Yeah, yeah. That's so terrible. fast, you yeah, and I. I know, I know. Mm -hmm. It's because I love being <laughs> I think what happens is, what happens is we both get very excited and then it's over before we had intended it. To. I'm speechless. Yeah. Melina Kalakaridis, everybody, we'll be right back. So I got 15 months left? Yes. I don't know, actually. I think with the CBS executive, I don't know if 15 months is the way it's going to go. That's going on. Yeah. Maybe a little less. We might be a little, little less. Is it just that... me, is it just me, Craig? Or yeah. does the CBS sensor look a little bit like a stripper? <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm you know what? You know what the hairs to one side, the glasses, yeah, yeah. the buttonable shirt. And you can do nothing because that is prime time, bitch. I know. Yeah. Yeah. Prime time. There you go.